Just waiting for the bit rate to settle down, guys. Everything just seems to have fucking crashed. Thing seems to be settling down a bit now. Bit rates coming back up. It's all steady, which is good. Turn the music down a bit. Just waiting for a delivery to come through. Uh, what mission we doing? I completely forgot. Grow and harvest flux weed. Easy enough. That's just flying on the broom. Acquire all three combat plants and use them simultaneously. But I've got all the plants. I can't 
remember if I had Fluxweed. I don't know where I'm at on the map. Ah, that's the meat. Uh, what's his face? Yes. No, we don't want to do that yet. No. I'm not even tracking that, so why is it? Yeah, I think I got the flux read. Hello, James, mate. I know I got all three combat bands. Again, best have me on quiet. Uh, world map, let's go pick a fight in a forest. Right, I'm gonna go here, but I'm gonna set a point over there and we'll walk through the forest. Craig will tell you off, man. Titties is his thing. Might get upset. Especially if you play with his titties. I need it to get rid of this fuck. Crack. On track. He might get upset if you play with his titties like. one of them buttons that I put in there just for you. Craig got his titties button. You got your fucking potato button. Oh yeah, this is lots of dudes. You're the little sod that saved the swivelers. There's that one. Oh, There's that one. <laughs> Man, you you all agree. Agree. That one. Little 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 
We got there in the end. Good freedom. What's that? Now it falls. <laughs> I need to say. Um. James is just gonna spam fucking potato all day now. Head towards the feckin' purple thing. Oh, sugar plums. Yeah, oh, you can play that one, Shorty. That's Shorty's new favourite one. It used to be a fucking doodoot. Now it's grab his dick and twist it. Or pull my wiener. Just obsessed with wins. Briggs in luck. Climb up that one. Ah, TMI, shorty. TMI. in his ass.
Confirm them. In your ass. I have on street. My job. Unlock it. Bastard. I was on the other file, I could have gotten that. I haven't been to the beast class yet. These rocks have seen better days. Revelio. So I haven't got the bag. Good job, there's no sound on James. Really, you can't jump over that fucking tiny wall. My God, this fucking Let's guy. Let's see what's up your sleeve this time, Merlin. When the clouds are dark, is always the best time to strike. It's as if nature has seven not move while there's such a fuss over poaching. There's enough beast flesh for everyone. <laughs> What have you done? Killed him, that's what I don't see. We got him, Leviosa. Akio. Rebellion. M2 haven't got... That hasn't got stone. They've all got stones on the top. These two haven't. Do I have to fix them, maybe? Repair one. Got some of them. I'm just trying to figure this out.
Revelio. and get off. Leviosa! We got him, Leviosa! Oh, there's quests all over the place, Shorty. Rebellion. That's, what I, that's what I love about the game. Uh. It reminds me of Skyrim, the amount of quests that you can do. struggling to figure this one out because I can't pick anything up. As soon as I get down on this, the leaves go. I don't know if I'm meant to get something to put on the top. Hold on, hold on. Repairer. James is out of Pokeballs. 
You'd have to go to the poking shop and get some more. If you scroll down, it should be on the underneath the page. Further down, you'll be able to go get some more. These Merlin trials won't get the best of me. Aha! Fucking sussed Fuck you! There you go, shorty, you know how to fix that one if you come across it. But yeah, I'm just waiting for the shock mount to turn up for this. So I've managed to get the arm over this side where I couldn't get it last time. It took some wangling and me fucking getting on my hands and knees under the desk. It's fucking hurt. Uh, I've been able to mount the mic where I want it. Which is good. Um, I should investigate. Show yourself. You're to hide yeah, now. are you actually going to get that fucking man cave sorted out, Bri? Rebellion. Yeah, I'm quite chuffed with what I've managed to get. To say I'm just... Didn't know you can't get beer with it, mate. Just everybody seems to think I'm a pisshead, so... Name of my channel points, beer tokens. with a red mask. Even got a red scarf. Look at that. That's a shame, James. Roll boggies.
Hello. Do you have anything for sale? That I do. But mm, uh, that I do. What's a student like yourself doing out here? Got yourself lost, did you? Hey, James. He's Scottish. Just exploring the countryside a bit. Hi. <laughs> nice to break the routine now and then. Bit of a wanderer myself, in fact. The name's Leopold Babcock, and I am indeed here to sell. <laughs> I wouldn't dare say. What do you say, my young friend? A measure of safety for the path ahead? Something to consider. Hi. Let me know. What do you have for sale? See if there's something you need. Nothing I need, but I'm here to sell shit. I shall hope to do business with you again. <laughs> That's been a pleasure. You in some sort of trouble? Nearly attacked by wolves, I was. Only just escaped with my life. I need to be better prepared next time. Could use some thunder brew. I don't suppose a student like yourself would be in possession of such a thing? I'm afraid not. I'd help you if I could, but I don't actually have anything with me. Well, that is unfortunate. I was hoping you'd be better prepared. Piggy bitch, you haven't got any either, so you can shut the fuck up. Is the fucking student that has to have, eh? Seven followers away from hitting three hundred and fifty, Craig. I'm up to 343. I need to return to garlic. Uh, Houses. Yeah, seven followers away from hitting 350. Nope. What are you up to now? The wife put a put down. What they do? Meeting cancelled. Nice. Perhaps a hybrid. Bouncing tentacular. I've finished the activities you assigned me, Professor Garlic. Wonderful. I hope you gained a greater appreciation for the flora in our lives. I am for... Just yesterday, I... Well, if there's one thing... Now, ready to learn flippendo? Chin up, keep a light grip, and it's all in the wrist. Let's see you give it a go. Oh, it's all in the wrist. You will want to focus with this spell. Nothing as mortifying as knocking back a colleague when all you wanted to do was move a few parts. Wonderfully done! 
If you'd like to practice a bit more, you're welcome to do so here in the greenhouse. Just... I would say, kind of nice to go pick them up if you've nicked the car, like. Nice to see you, my young friend. Yep, whatever. We've got to go pick them up from like James.
somewhere. There it is. To tomorrow, shorty. How did you get on with those tasks? Madam Kagawa, I completed the list of tasks you assigned. Wonderful. I trust you became more familiar with your broom through the process? Yes, Professor. That's good to hear. Keep it up, and perhaps one day you'll have a spot on the Quidditch team. If Black ever permits Quidditch again. Well, with those tasks out of the way, let us get started. Glacius. Pay attention to your wand work. Well done. I'd recommend that you practice your new spell here in my office before taking it out into the world.
What are you doing out here? Challenging you to a game of Summoner's Court. I think it's time you faced a real opponent, outside of Ronan's little lesson in charms class. Summoner's Court isn't just a game. It's a battle of skill, a test of a witch or wizard's metal. What say? is back. Oh, it's me last monster. Actually, Greg, um, I'm in. Let's do it. Brilliant. Leo's off college on Wednesdays and Thursdays. Summoners so get him to watch the dog. The Ever-changing game. Don't have to worry about the dog. Okay. 
Yeah, fucking hell. I want it as luminous green as I can get it. Nothing to it. Try to beat that. Yeah. Lucky shot. Okay. That was a fucking lucky you cheeky bastard. That was all, all the skill. Wrist. Shit. Box. Didn't think you were a match for me. Wait, did I win? I won. <laughs> we should have bet a few galleons on that round. Care to go again? Yes. I'm game for another round. Grand. You could use the practice. Fucking oh, cheeky twat. Summoner's Court. The ever-changing game. Akio. Nothing to it. Yeah, nothing to it. Akio. Was one for the ages. Okay. Try to beat that. I'll let you have that one. Okay. Because I don't push that in. Later Not on. bad. Okay. Not bad. Well done. You beat me. Yes, I beat you. Yeah. What's it? Bit of good luck. That's all. I'm not lucky. I'm simply better than you. All right, fine. You're right. <laughs> you're better than me. I'll Twat let the others bag. know you're good enough to keep playing. The others? I lost seven matches in a row to Samantha Dale. The others who play Summoner's Court thought that if you couldn't beat me, you wouldn't be enough of a challenge. Just getting some people tabbed open on Twitch.
just jumped into Dread Stream Craig, and for some reason it unfollowed them, and I don't know why. But I've got him on a hundred percent, and I can't hear a fucking thing like. Two seconds, somebody at my door. Got me shop mount. That's a hefty shop mount that way. Jeebus. Right, just gotta disconnect the mic a second.
There we can. Check, check. Fucking mic's working. Got it back on the boom. This is fucking awesome. Everything is awesome. Now the mic shouldn't keep cutting out on us. Nope. It come up that he followed us. Um, Chin up, Leander. Keep practicing and you'll get better. Yes, did he? I suppose Day before. Right. I'll let the others know that your um, method's been tested and that you passed. So I was like, ah. So I followed him back, but I've not. Like I said, I thought it was the same account and it, my account had just unfollowed him for some reason. Some reason, which has happened before. Um. But no, it's a new account. Don't know why. Don't know what's happened, but yeah, it looks like it's a new account. Um, I say why, I've no idea, but yeah. I don't know if something's happened with somebody else or or what, but No idea, mate. No idea. Morning, Albert. I don't know what quest to do. I might have to do this one. I might have to go and meet him at the tower. You had a few raids yesterday, Albert. 
you had quite a few people in your stream at one point. Is it hat raided you? Yeah, I'm good, mate. I'm just getting the uh, mount for me mic. So me mic's now back on the the boom arm thing. Revelio. So it's not me desk again, which is nice. Which means the sound should be more consistent. Like I say, I was lurking and playing. I was playing with Eltoy there. We were in zombies and... Um, I kept nipping into your stream and having a look and noticed that Hat had raided you and I think you were up like 20 odd views at one point. See, I might not say a huge amount when I'm in people's streams, but the likes of now, I've got three people tabbed open on the PC. Even though I'm streaming myself, I'm in another people's three streams. It just helps with numbers. No. Even though I'm streaming, I still like to show my support to other people as well. to learn Arresto Momentum, the slowing charm. It allows you to freeze objects or people in mid-air. Simply complete a few tasks and then come and see me. Now I get that when I'm fucking all the way over here. I'd rather do them than me in quests. Oh, let's get out of this forest. Yeah, this mic doesn't look like it should fit on this stand, like.
Oh, I'm not meant to be popping these ones yet. That didn't count for anything. Okay, leave them. Mate, as long as you had fun, that's all that matters. It's all that matters. As long as you enjoyed it. What do you have in store for me this time? Yeah, Jean, as long as you enjoyed it, Albert, that's all that matters. The thing I find different with your streams is you give a lot of information out about the trucks, why you're doing things, what you're doing it for. Rebellion. And a lot of people don't do that. Somewhere. Rebellion. But the wrong ones in the wrong hole. <laughs> like I've never said that before. There's a lot of people don't do that and don't think about that. Oh, fuck. The <laughs> Fucking glitched. Oh, for fuck's sake. Glitched into the fucking rocks.
Yeah, I'm quite impressed with this mic. Now that I've got the thing for it. I don't know what I'm going to do for this. Um. One minute thirty nine. Let's see if it's enough. I fucking love this song. Right, there's none in that one. Good. None in that one. Awesome. It is, mate, yeah. Um, I had to buy a shock mount for it. Um, even though I'd spent a decent, what I consider, a decent amount of money on the mic, I already had the arm from my last microphone. Um, but it didn't come with the adapter for it to fit onto this boom arm that I've got. So I had to buy a, a shock mount for it as well. Uh, which I didn't know about at the time, but... Yeah, it's literally just arrived. Like, ten minutes ago. So, now I've got the mic back on the big arm that you see everybody using. So it's not sat on the desk. So it's closer to me. Um... Now I should be able to go through the filters and set up the filters again. With being able to have the mic so close. Uh, where did them fucking balls just go? There they are. I lost me marbles fucking years ago. Um, so yeah. I've gone from a... Uh, I'm going to climb up this side this time. Uh, the microphone I was using cost me, it was either 25 or 30 pounds, so you're talking $35, uh, to this one being 125 pounds, so about $130, $135 for this microphone. Rebellion. Uh, so it's a big difference for me. Oh, shit, those balls need to go in there. Where are them balls? Where are them balls? Oh, there. Um, so yeah, it was a big, a big expense. Revelio. Streaming's not as easy as people think. It's not just a case of turning on your your console and making money. It's not. And you don't make as much as people think you do either. My last payout was October or November. I've not had one since. Uh, I'll get a one in February, but it'll be 40 quid. That's it. By the time Twitch take their amount, and then it converts from dollars to pounds, I get about 40 quid. Why 
Why does it keep fucking diving down? I mean, I always said I was never in it for the money. It's a hobby. But the amount of money I've put into it now, just as a hobby, need to start making some money back. Probably looking. That's I'm it. in the region of about 1,000, 1,100 into the stream, and you're lucky if I've had 200 out of it. So yeah, it would be uh, nice to start making some money back because it's bloody expensive. <laughs> I mean, a big chunk of that was my PC, to be fair. Uh, where am I going? Where am I going? Where have I got to return to? Ah, so, she's just on the outskirts. So... I go so if I go Bell Tower and go there. Yeah, the ad revenue sucks. Um, I've got ads on. Can't remember what they set up as. I really can't. I set them up when I first set the stream up. And now can't remember where to change them. <laughs> but, like I say, Twitch take 50% of what you make. So you have to make $100 to get a $50 payout. So they take 50% of the bitties that you get, even though it's like £1.36 for 100, they take 50% of it. Uh, then it's like 4 99 or 5 99 for the subscription, they take half of that. why a lot of people are moving to kick because you get 95% of your subscriptions and donations over there have you finished your assignment reporting back professor assignments all finished well done shows good discipline wisdom is a golden snitch as they say and you're proving a skilled seeker in that regard let us practice our restore momentum a charm, incidentally, created to stop Quaffles from plummeting straight to the ground during a Quidditch match. Precise, deliberate movements.
Very good. I recommend practicing your new spell as much as possible. Perhaps before you leave here. Arrest my momentum. That's it. Keep it up. I mean, I did hear a, a rumor, and I say rumor in the, the loosest term, that Kick were on about paying their streamers $16 an hour, so you were actually getting an hourly rate, but what comes of that, I've no idea. Like I say, it was just a rumor. you, Gryffindor. Yes. Amelda Rays? Albie Week sent me. <laughs> Did he now? Still tinkering with his broom upgrade, no doubt. I tried to help him once. He nitpicked my flying technique, and that was the end of that. The nerve. Why is he roping you into his broom testing silliness? You've barely started flying from what I know. Caught wind of you showing off in flying class with Clopton. Seems someone's jealous of my skills on a broom. Me? Slytherin Quidditch captain. Jealous of you? Everyone knows that class is only for beginners, troublemakers, and bumbling baboons. But for some reason, now people think you're competition. Ugh, I can't be having that. Perhaps I am competition. You're not even Slytherin. Could be a useless squib for all I know. Enough of this. Only one way to find out who's the better flyer. I hold one of the fastest times on this course. Let's see if you can beat it. Slytherin versus Gryffindor. Actually, why not? I can beat your record. I'm so looking forward to seeing you lose. I better fucking win now. <laughs> I'm shit at flying.
success. You can't determine skill from one single trial. Surely my win means something. Uh, you're not terrible, but you're still going to have to prove yourself if you want to earn my respect. I don't want respect from the likes of you. All you do is insult people. You and everyone else need to get a thicker skin. Anyway, I'm moving on to the next course. It's near Irondale and offers a much tougher challenge. You can try to prepare by racing this course again. Just check in at the podium where the leaderboard is. You can check your time and start the race. We'll see next time if your win here was more than just a fluke. Whilst on an errand for Albie Weeks. Yes, I'm professional. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Suck on that bitch tits. I suspect Mr. Weeks will be glad to hear how I fared. <laughs> Random outburst. Here's the insult of the day, bitch tits. We've something to report, I hope. Mr. Weeks, I'm just I was able to set a record on my broom. Incredible! Miss Ray must have been shocked. Hogwarts. Tell me, how was the broom? A little turbulent, and it's wanting for a bit of speed, but it fared well enough. I will say that she it tended to drift eye. a bit to the left on certain turns. Heard a slight swoosh when I dipped. Oh, thank you. Hmm. That's precisely what I needed to know. Drifted, eh? I shall get to work immediately. Even the naysayers will be forced to admit that my work's had potential all along. Why would anyone doubt your ability to upgrade brooms? Oh, you'd be surprised. People get set in their ways, worry that fiddling with what's working fine will somehow ruin it. <sighs> Those people don't appreciate the sense of freedom that comes with quality broom flight, nor do they appreciate all that's involved in the creative process. I have a friend in Rome runs a shop like mine, says it's worse there. <laughs> of course, they do nap in the afternoons from what I hear. And where would we be without enhancements? I mean, if Elliot Smethick had let the you naysayers get wrong. to him, we would never have had the cushioning if they charm. Nap in the afternoon. I don't listen to him. Sounds like my kind of place. I'm excited to hear more. I have a very good feeling about this upgrade. I guarantee you'll be pleased. Expect to hear from me soon. Hmm. How to address the issue of altitude as it relates to speed? Ah! 
Nice doing business with you. Well, can I not upgrade the broom I've got? Thanks for stopping by. Hope to see you again. Or can I just change what it looks like? Oh, like, that, that looks like he's got a more comfortable uh, seat on it, like. We'll go with that one. I want to go there too. Has the music stopped again or has it just gone very fucking quiet? Oh, it stopped. There we go, music's back. <laughs> My dragon coat. Now he looks a bit evil. Rebellion. I thought I heard a book. <laughs> I did hear a book. It's off to the right door. It's there. Uh, Rebellion. Oh, look at that, and there's the last one. That should be 15 of 15, I think. Yes! Got some range on it, I guess. Revelio. Lumos. It's literally just out here. I 
it does literally look like it's just down here. Is there a flutter by nearby? There it is. I'm walking places because like I say I'm waiting for the caretaker to send an owl because he gives me the uh, spell so I can pick locks. Reminds me of the time I nearly fell out of a car at Green Dots. I was only young mine. We're not like I'd fall out now. Lucky if I fit in one now. Good for you. I won't rest until you're dead. Luma. Protego. Too late for you to learn the error of your ways. Revelio. I've literally gotten out. That sucks. But then again. Nope, they've gotten out. Can't bash that. We well, yeah, have noticed I'm getting quite tired through the day and I think it's because I'm sat in front of you guys <laughs> all day and I sit and do this what are the seven best ever eaten? on average seven hours a day Monday to Friday I know it doesn't oh, sound like a lot but I'm not by. physically moving I'm literally just <laughs> sitting I'm just getting tired no! so I'm thinking about taking a Wednesday off as well as a weekend so it means I'd only be streaming Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday. Um, but obviously, you, some of you guys, pay a subscription to watch me stream. So I want to put it to you guys. What do you think? Or do you just think? Take an hour off each day and do five or six hours instead of six to eight. So it would be like starting at 10, finishing at 2. Monday to Friday. Or stick with what I'm doing and take a full day off on a Wednesday. As well as the weekends. Revelio. I don't know, Shorty, that's why I'm asking. I don't know. Because obviously you guys watch to pay me stream. That's what the subscription's for. So... 
I don't want to feel like I'm ripping people off. Up a horse field is being terrorised by Ranrock's loyalists. It's not right. I couldn't help but overhear. Did you mention Ranrock's loyalists? I did. <sighs> Never imagined they'd you know act this I'm deadly. Like. I'm Claire Beaumont, by the way. Nice to meet you. Ranrock and his followers have set up camp here. No regard for our beloved hamlet or our livelihoods. Ruthless. My brother Baldov dared to stand up to them and ended up in St Mungo's. Simply at my wit's end. The other issue I've got is quite a few of my viewers come from America. I'm unfortunately quite familiar with Ranrock's loyalists. So it might mean Perhaps I if can I do something. Ten or two, I might miss Much a lot as I of would love to be rid of them, I wouldn't want you to risk injury or worse. Please be cautious. We should not have to live in fear. This is our home. So if you notice, my stream didn't really pick up till about one, two o'clock yesterday. Sat with Rebellion. about five or six viewers all the way through till about one o'clock. It seems as though things are getting worse. Best be on my guard. And that's when things started to pick up. See, this is why I'm waiting for the caretaker to get in touch. Because on a night time, they glow. And I can capture them on a night time. And that's what I need to do. But I've got to wait for the caretaker to get in touch. Before I can start that mission. Rebellion. I know that because obviously I've got my other save file. But I'm running the game through on this save. On the stream. So people can see it from start to finish. Bardo Beaumont should have returned by now, had by Dark Wizard people. Let's go smash some goblins. It's not that I want the break shorty, I need it. Just so I can get a good start on moving. I think that's why I'm getting so tired, because I'm just sad all day. Jesus, last week I was literally falling asleep on stream. My eyes were closing and everything. Rebellion. I've already cleared these two camps on the way to this village. Defender. What do you think? 
Protego. Why can't I? No, that's better for you, dude. I can bring up. takes breaks every Ooh, couple of hours. Cleared. Madame Beaumont will be glad to hear that. Could try that. I've not actually been in his stream in a little time, actually, now you've said his name. Old Shane man Shorty. Bardolf thought dark magic was the answer. I reckon... Bro Excuse me. Did you say something about Bardolf Beaumont? I did. I don't think we've met. I was just worrying about Claire Beaumont's brother, Bardolf. Rumour is he was seen in the forest practising dark magic. Saw him myself near some ruins with Rookwood's lot I did. I fear he got him... I'd help search for him. I can certainly look out for him. Any help would be appreciated. I can tell you. Claire will be at her shop if you'd like to... Revelio. Oh, see, now I've stopped and talked to her. It's took near the frickin' thing off. Where's she at? There. I do miss the bustle of business. Poor customers. Afraid to venture out. Hello, Madam Beaumont. Good news. I was able to clear out Ranrock's camps. You cleared them out? How? I managed to catch them off guard. When my brother returns, this news will mean the world to him. You saved our hamlet, my young friend. This will not be forgotten. I fear for other hamlets, truly. Ranrock and his lot are unlike any goblins I've ever seen. What do you have for sale? What are you looking for, exactly? Thank you. Sincerely. Marvellous. I could always use more of these.
Rebellion. You can feed a beast, or it can feed you. If you get my meaning. Past the river near the forest. I must be on the right track. It isn't Nora Trent. Defender! I heard something. I'm sure it'll be hard if they get a move. There's a challenge about here somewhere. It's there. And then that ball needs to come down here and go into there. Oh, here's a pleasant surprise. easy one that one right where was I going yes up here go find out what happened to this dude Barrels. There's one. How oh, the fucking hell did you hit there then? Yeah. Protego. Confringo. Defender.
Jeebus. Revelio. Just realized jelly rolls on. An entry from Bardolf's journal. He overheard whispers, a plan, something to do with him. This mentions in theory, and something about it being Bardolf's turn next. Revelio. Oh, Mint, I've got me asylum mask. I like Jelly Roll. I can't take credit for it. Uh, I come across Jelly Roll on Flame and Dragon stream. Uh, which I don't get to see a lot of now he's changed job. He used to... He used to be, yeah, work nights. So he was streaming through the day when I could catch him. But uh, he's changed his schedule now, obviously, with him. He's now working through the day, so I don't really get to catch his streams anymore. Revelio. I've just got a report pack. I must have found everything. Right, I'm just going to nip to the loo, guys. I'll be two seconds. The monster's kicking in. some of that broth that we made the other day. It's been sat in the fridge for 24 hours now. Oh, two seconds, there's my phone. What?
I love that this thing's got a mute button on it. Um, is it four? Is that it? Is that the one I want? Yes, that's the one I want. Yeah, the good truck simulator game. I have get an update the 15th of this month. What is that like? Um... American Truck Simulator or Euro Truck Sim. That is the one I'm doing, isn't it? Yeah, one track quest. Access to my brother's Steam account, and he's got one of the truck simulators. Uh, I tried it, but then I got into uh, that was before I started really streaming. Uh, but I've sat on the PC. What was I doing? Oh yeah, gear. Chief Prankster called.
show. It seems to be oh, the anticipated. You'll have to fight eventually. In your bombs. Let's see you survive that. You'll feel that tomorrow. If you lost a plum, little fool. Confringo. I've actually got the chance of landing a really good steering wheel. Like a really good one. Off Eltoy's dad. Um, it's like 500 quids worth of steering wheel, but it doesn't work on truck sim. Uh, well, I know it doesn't work on, I think it's American truck sim. I don't know about the others. Um, so he's never used it because it doesn't work on them. But I, I, I yeah, I don't know whether to lend it because obviously it's brand new and it's fucking expensive. But he's said I could lend it till somebody wants to buy it off him. So I can't afford to buy it off him. Yeah, I was looking at some, um, and it, it, my God, they're fucking expensive. I don't want to go into the fucking tower. I need to go back to where this woman is. Fuck's sake. Yeah, um, the only thing, if I get a wheel, I want one with the uh, force, force pushback. Everybody said if I get a wheel, make sure it has that. Um, I mean, I found a, what I would class as a basic wheel, because it was only a hundred and something pound. Madam Beaumont. But that was just the wheel. I believe I have some it, news it didn't come with the pedals Adam? or anything like that. What do you know of my brother?
I regret to say that Bardolf had been turned into an inferior, and I had to kill him. What? But, but how could you possibly think that an inferior was my brother Bardolf? That's absurd. He was wearing a woolen jumper, hand knitted. <gasps> no, no, this can't be. I'm truly sorry. I wish it had been better news. I wish you well, Madame Bernard. <laughs> what more could I have done? Oh, Bardolf! Bardolf! Rebellion! Let's see, for the price of them. And how much I would use it. I can't see the point in me getting one. Although I did find, like you say, some some decent uh you know, some decent priced ones. For how much I would use it. It's just not worth it. Not for me anyway. <laughs> There's something else. How do I get up there? How do I get in there? Yeah, how the fuck do I get up there? Them ladders there, look. <laughs> Dumbass. Unidentified fierce item. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, some of them gaming rigs are fucking unreal. Um, the ones where they've got the curved monitors that go all the way around and they've got the seat, they've got it actually built into a car. And it's uh, Jesus. I mean, you must Not have sure to seriously like love driving games to put that much money into one of them. Oh, there we go. That goes with my dark setup that I've got going on. No, because I haven't got the thing to get into the hoose. So, I think I have to go meet Professor Fig. Yeah, I've seen them. Like I say, I've seen the ones that have actually been built inside cars. They've got chopped the front end of a car off in a scrapyard, put it inside the house, and then built inside that 
and it it literally look just looks like the front end of a car with and it's like holy shit work and dashboard a lot it's nuts but like you say you've got to have some serious money to do that Or have a serious sponsor behind you that sponsors your streams. That's willing to put in the money to build you something like that. We say I would never get that type of sponsorship if I was ever to get offered it. Because I'm a variety streamer. I don't just stream one game. I tell you what though, this past couple of days I'm starting to uh, think have I made the right choice with pre-ordering expeditions. I'm awfully close to cancelling the, the pre-order for it. There's not one person that I've spoken to that's actually excited for coming out. Everybody's dubious. I think nobody's willing to fork out the money straight away unless you're a die-hard SnowRunner fan. Be a good thing for me because a lot of people are intriguing pace. Tower. I could view. corner the sort of the no streaming idea. of it, if you will. But yeah. Oh, you would make yeah, I mean the room I'm in now, I can Over touch here. the wall in front of me and the wall behind me. Uh, and just about touch the walls either end. My little stream room is a cupboard. So I couldn't do it. What? You noisy bugger. What? Wait there, wait till I move the mic. What? Are you wanting to come and say hi? Come on then. Come and say hi then. Oh, come on then. Come on then. You big, bloody, softy. Come here. Come here. Bruce. Oh. Wait, wait, I move back a bit. Come on then. Oh. There you go. That, that paw's nearly in my face. Thank you. What? What are you after? What? You need to go out. You need to go out. Huh? You need to go out. <laughs> out. Okay. Two seconds, guys.
Nah, he didn't want to be internet famous or want to go out. He, he, he wanted We're a Scooby alone. snack. We are not. Ranrock's loyalists. Around a dozen, I can see, but could be more. Can't we operate past them into the tower? We could, but we've no idea what's in the tower. More importantly, however, I'd like to know why they're here. They've set up camp just ahead. I suggest we investigate a little before doing anything else. Let's go. Well, this isn't ideal. No, it isn't. This way. And I'd suggest we use the disillusionment charm here. No sense in announcing our arrival. When you say more content, do you mean more streamers streaming it? Oh, this day's gone on too long. Quickly now. Stay hidden and cast Petrificus Totalus. Petrificus Totalus. Well done. Oh, there must be something here. Ramrock said so. Nothing over here. Petrificus Totalus. Why is a grapple you are? Orders, directly from Ranrock. These orders indicate that they're after something to do with names. What names? And why here? Like more things to do, more bridges to fix things. Oh, okay. Issues streaming it. Uh, more variety of trucks. Yeah, I wouldn't mind to see a few more modern trucks in it. Revelio. It's more than mere coincidence that we encountered Ranrock's loyalists here. Looks like we found the entrance. It's locked.
an unlocking charm. Very handy. No time now, but if you don't learn it soon enough, we can work on it back at the castle. Someone was an avid reader. Can't say I'm familiar with many of these titles. I wonder who this is. With robes like that, it could be anyone. And these brooms have been enchanted for centuries. Never seen an enchantment last this long. Welcome to San Bacar's Tower. Hello, Professor. Did you say San Bacar's Tower? I did. Professor Bacar is a keeper you have yet to encounter. I'm glad to see that I was correct in presuming that we would meet again soon after our last encounter. Though I surmise, based on the commotion I heard, that you did not have an easy time getting to me. We did not, Professor. We encountered goblins outside the tower. That goblins were aware of my vault is disquieting enough. But if they have also made a connection to this tower, then the threat may be greater than I thought. All the more reason for us to move forward. Downstairs, near the entry, a reservoir of ancient magic, like those you've seen before, has been unlocked. Command it to access a doorway. I'm afraid I cannot say more. As Professor Fig cannot join you, he and I will, in time, see you back at the map chamber. Remember what you see. We're going to need to understand how Ranrock's loyalists knew about a tower that once belonged to a keeper. For the moment, however, You've more important things to set your mind to. A reservoir of ancient magic, I believe? Yes, sir. Then I shall leave matters in your increasingly capable hands. That said, be careful. I will, sir. I'll see you back in the map chamber. A reservoir of ancient magic, downstairs, near the entry. The first trial. Let's go. I've seen this before. Um, I don't think I've actually section. got any of the yearly passes. I might have year two because I think it was free at one point. I do have a few of the DLCs. Um, it, only because they were on sale for a couple of quid. But I don't have a lot of the stuff that you <laughs> lifers have that have been playing it for years. That must have done something. Best have a look around.
Rebellion. Traces of ancient magic. Something must be different. These are never a welcome sight. At least I know what to expect this time. for me. <sighs> Them stairs are freaky as fuck. <laughs> These look familiar. Cheers. I presume I'm looking for traces of ancient magic, but where?
Seems I ought to explore this archway from both sides. No shit, Sherlock. What did that burst of magic change on both sides of the archway? Something must be different. There's now that over there. Right. That's what I need, I think. Uh, ladder. Uh, there we go. Now what? Are you pissed to me? Oh, what the fuck am I had are these floors? Oh, that's not good. Ah, oh, shit. There'd be a few of them. He's jumping. Hello? Tell the difference with the mic now. I've got it on the the stand. Yeah, uh, on the arm instead of the stand. Sorry.
I know yesterday, Craig was saying that the sound kept dropping. It was getting loud and then quiet and loud and then quiet. But that's when I had all the filters on the, the mic. I mean, the filters are still on, but I've got them set as default at the minute. So I should be able to go back in and put all the settings back on them. Is it just Wigan World portions? Or it I've got too much shit out together. I can't even take credit for Dax either. That came from the same person, Flame and Dragon. on here as well. I've got to be a man, uh, depression, be a god, uh, alcohol. I've got a few of Dax's stuff on here, like.
you. <laughs> what a relief. Yeah, a lot of them are, because they're not restricted by the big label saying, no, we want you to look like this or sound like this. So a lot of the the, ind the independent artists, in my eyes, are the better artists Another at the pensive. moment. Oh, I love this song as well, Yellow Wolf. Probably the only one of Yellow Wolf's songs that I do like, but it's a bloody good one. Figure the world around you is remarkable. What is it? My father isn't getting better. I don't think he'll ever recover from the death of my brother. It is agonizing to see those we love suffer. The drought was years ago. The pain of losing him is as deep for him now as if it had happened only yesterday. He doesn't need pretty pillars, he needs peace. What if I could help him, Professor? You do so much for your father already. It's not enough. I want to take away his pain. It is tempting, I know, to use this magic that you're mastering to transfigure more than the physical world. But human emotion now, is a potent force unto itself. Even the most well-meaning and competent witch cannot possibly know the consequences of irrevocably manipulating it. So I'm to already. watch Jesus. as my father's pain destroys him. It is not your pain to take. Every year, a student sees something sillier than I could ever imagine in their tea leaves. Oh, Miss Morgana, welcome back to Hogwarts, Professor. That's going to take some getting used to. Mm. Professor Rickwood? I was so pleased to hear that you'd accepted the position of Defense Against the Dark Arts, Professor. Sit, sit, Isadora. Tell us about your travels. I was actually hoping that you and the others might join me at my home this evening. There's much I'd like to share with you. That would be delightful. We shall let the others know. Very well. I shall see you then. So she's gone from a student to a professor. Hmm. Another memory. Now to find a way out of here. You do, mate, yeah. I was meant to get something to eat. Stone. That must be the way back to the map chamber. <laughs> That's the one thing about streaming that I hate. What, what have, have we here? Eaten. I'm a student at All Hogwarts, I had yesterday sir. was a couple of packets of crisps. Fig. Professor Charles I don't think Rookwood I actually had furnace. any proper food yesterday. Has someone completed the first trial? I have, Professor. And I've had Rookwood. nothing to do either. We saw you in the pensive in Gringotts, with Professor Rackham. Indeed. So, you found the port key to access Professor Rackham's vault, and you deciphered the map within the pocket you found floating above that pensive. 
I did. I found something that I can't identify floating above the last pensive. Ah, yes. You will find a similar artifact in each trial. You must take care to keep them safe. You'll need them to complete the journey we have set forth for you. Once you have them all, we will tell you what to do with them. Very well. Are you able to tell me anything about the next trial? Before you proceed, I would like to speak with Charles regarding the urgent situation involving the goblins. The goblins? The student has seen traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. They and their mentor, Professor Fig, not only encountered goblins lurking outside of San Bacar's tower, they also encountered a powerful goblin in my vault at Gringotts. Hmm. I'm afraid it would be wise to halt the trials until we know more. We shall defer to you in this matter, of course. Now then... Wait, Professor. The name Rookwood. Do you think... That there's a connection to Victor? Perhaps. But we can't be sure of its significance, if any. For now, tell me what you saw in the pensive. Before the witch from the last pensive, Isadora, became a Hogwarts professor, she argued with Professor Rackham about using magic to remove pain. Hmm. Hopefully the next pensive provides more context. For now, we should learn what Ramrock knows. I will be honest, I've no idea where to start. Actually, I might know of someone. I saw Serona at the Three Broomsticks speaking to a goblin once. They seemed friendly. Well, it's worth a try. See what you can find out. Of course, don't forget... My studies. Yes, sir. Let's see, I've got some uh, homemade broth. Uh, that my wife made the other day. It's in the fridge. It always tastes better the day after or a couple of days later, so... Professor? Have you encountered swirling traces of magic in the world? Uh, aside from those along our path? Not that I recall. What are I've they? I've got time to have Evidence some of that before. I've got to go and get the little one from school. The power of ancient magic during our time. If I am correct, now. and I usually am, you should be able to use them to inform and enhance your own magic. Thank you, sir. I will look out for them. Another good one by Dax Joker. I like Breathe as well. That's another good one. I should ask Serona at the Three Broom. I've got spectacular news. The broom upgrade's ready. Ha! Stop by the shop when you can. <laughs> broom upgrade. I hope you will come and see uh -huh. me about a pressing and highly confidential matter at your earliest convenience. I believe that we may be able to help each other. That's the one I wanted. But what I'm going to do, guys, I'm actually going to go and heat some of that stuff up before I forget and it's too late. So we're going to take a break. We're going to take Albert up on his offer. So you know go grab a snack. I will be about 10 minutes. Please see me after class once you have completed the tasks I've set for you. I would like to teach you Descendo, useful for pulling objects to the ground.
Right, food's done. Well, it's ready. Uh, dear God, to be a man, two of my favourites. Yep. Definitely agree. Now I can put it like this. And I can turn my camera off. And then at least we're on the same screen. So, where's my webcam? There we go. Oh yeah, they are probably two of my favourite songs as well, from Dax. Breathe is definitely up there as well. Uh, I can't remember what it's called, the name of the song, but the one where he gets bitten off the vampire woman. Uh, I like that one as well. See, I like Tom McDonald as well. He's a very controversial rabbi. Do I agree with half the stuff he says? No. Do I enjoy his music though? Yes. Yeah, I know, man. I thought it would be cool if you could still see it. Um, so I put the logo on that has the clear background. Uh, instead of the black one. So I've got two. One with a clear background and one that uh, is black. So it blacks everything out. Just something different. I mean, I can change it if you want. I can put the other one back on. Trying to shovel it in. But, there. Uh. Yeah, it's just different. Obviously, when people have the break screen on, it's generally the whole thing that's covered. Which is what mine was.
think I'm gonna have to play and eat because I've got to go and get Bab soon. I'll just have to leave the camera off for a bit. This is proper comfort food, this, like. Shit, there's me alarm, man. Fuck. Rebellion. I haven't been called doing that one handed while trying to eat since you brought me that venomous. <laughs>
Hello again, Mr. Moon. Oh, I was hoping to see you again, my young friend. Uh, Gladwin Moon, a Hogwarts caretaker, at your service. First, uh, please allow me to apologize if I seemed a bit uh, unsteady when we last met. I'm afraid I had a he rather disconcerting encounter. Although I hear your visit to Hogsmeade was even more eventful than mine. Why don't you want spoilers, Shadow? I suppose you could call it eventful. I certainly wasn't expecting a troll attack. Oh, of course not. Uh, and from what I understand, the village was lucky you were there. In fact, my recent visit to Hogsmeade is the reason I was hoping to bump into you. I could use your help with something. Do you see that curious statue over there? Watch what happens when that light changes from day to night. Are you planning on playing this one, like Shadow? We are fortunate to have... Now, if you wouldn't mind humouring me for a moment, see if you can remove the moon from the statue. Go on, take the moon. Oh, but you are planning on getting it, then. It's on sale at the minute. It's like 40 or 45% off. Odd little contraptions, aren't they? It seems the statue vanishes once the moon is removed. Which, incidentally, can only be done at night. Uh, why don't you hold on to that one for now, and I'll explain more as we walk. But well, I'll not go anywhere. Um, did you look into that other game? Began appearing about the castle. A fair number have been strewn around Hogsmeade. Someone, it seems, is trying to torment me. You see, that day in Hogsmeade, I turned a corner and came face to face with a boggart, or, or shapeshifter, if you will, uh, which takes the form of whatever scares you most. And this one took the form of a demiguise. A demiguise? <gasps> yes! Terrifying creature that can see the future. Wholly unnerving. I encountered one when I was a lad in Korea. Terrible experience. Uh, those statues are demigises. The moons, I assume, are an uninspired play on my name. Some jackanapes used a boggart to learn my Take greatest it, you and Trigger are still there. And use it against me. I am my suspicion still as to the arc, scoundrel then. or scoundrels responsible. It is my hope that they will slip up and reveal themselves as the statues disappear. That is why I need your help in removing the statues. Why me? Hardly see is now it is. Frankly, uh, first, your daring do against those trolls in Oxmead has no, gained you a I'll not keep reputation here if you don't want spoilers. for fearlessness. Second, as macabre and hideous as a demiguise is, most would find my fear of them unwarranted. You, however, have seen how they affect me. I'm at my wit's end, young friend. I, I simply can't bring myself to go near them. In fact, I know two statues right here in the faculty tower. Uh, perhaps you could start simply by removing them so uh, I can go about my evening duties. I'd be glad to help you, Mr. Moon. Oh, I knew I could count on you. Uh, first, you know how to cast a disillusionment charm, correct? Mm. You'll want to do that before well, yeah, wandering the tower to. at night. Uh, you just need next, to start streaming again, both of you. The door is locked. However will you get in? Hmm. Alahamora, that's how. But what about curfew? Curfew? 
you? Oh, tosh. I sent you a bit like me when I was your age. Oh, the school was my oyster. <laughs> and I took advantage of it. Oh, everyone loved me for it. <laughs> oh, those were the days. Uh, now, you'll find one see anybody in the anymore prefect's apart from bathroom and the other in the hospital shorty. wing. Good luck. Oh, see Danny thank once you. in a blue moon. See you and Trigger once, twice a month now. Gets a bit quiet, you know. Hey, shorty. No worries, Shadow. Yep.
Glad it wasn't just me. Hello, Hamora. I need lock two for that one. Yeah, I'm already cloaked. Revenue. How did the key know I was there? I wouldn't care, I've got to do it again in a minute, Albert. I've got to go get the little one from school. Two, so there's two, that's five. Or nine, that's the tree. Not that one. So this one's the tree. Five spider, which is eight. Zero. So it's the first one. See if my maths was right. E. Revenue. If 
Spy cat just spying on the professors, are we? Boga. Had homemade broth. Oh, wait. So. In a British broth, you've got your. Pot the likes of your potato, leek, carrot, turnip, chicken stock. Uh, then you've got a, a ham hock, and you've got all the juices off that. And then lentils. Oh, it was lush. That was just some simple bread and butter with loads of salt and pepper. Mmm. How are your students getting on? Rather poorly, I'd say. Is that so? Uh, we're raising a generation of... When it's cold and wet and damp and miserable. Mate, it's one of the best meals you can I have. Be a this must be the prefect's bathroom. <laughs> Nearly got caught there. Alohomora. caught as soon as I go out here like oh maybe not my venomous tentacular not at the moment no plenty of other perils and pitfalls to send them my way though in the fridge, mate. I'll bring some over tomorrow if you want. I've got loads. Yeah. All right, mate. Yeah, I'll bring some over tomorrow.
I need to hurry up and get this so I can go get Babs. Not at the moment, no. Plenty of other people send them my way, though. The students are terribly disappointed about Quidditch being cancelled. Huh. I had planned to bet a few galleons on Hufflepuff. Revelio. I just need to get out here and then I can run and grab Babs. It's five to three. Hello, Mr. Moon. I have the moons you asked me to collect. Oh, goodness! You're as fearless right. as I am. Um, I will be An back in start. 15 minutes. If we can collect more, it may shed some light on who's behind all this. Of course. Peeves, he drove the previous caretaker Rapturous Carp to an early retirement with his intolerable buffoonery. But that does not explain the bogger in Oxme, does it? No. I am determined, with your help, to discover the identity of my tormentor.
I was back in it. Yeah, I'll bring you some over tomorrow, Craig. The short eaters. I know your dad probably will. It's definitely intriguing. I'd like to help you solve this mystery. You, my friend, are a gentle person and a, a scholar. And I have something to offer in exchange for your assistance. Now, remember, the moons are only retrievable at night. Thus, I encourage you to use a disillusionment when necessary. Understood. I shall keep an eye out. I appreciate that. I knew you were the one to ask for help. Uh, keep at it so we can solve this mystery. I hope you've been staying vigilant with those Demigai statues. Right. Rebellion. Now these statues can be fucking anywhere, and I can't remember where any of them are off the other one. I think I've only got four or five. Something close. Rebellion. It's like it's right on us. Rebellion. I think the best way I'm going to find these, because they're not just in the castle, they're in and around the castle and in the surrounding area. So I'm probably best off just doing missions. Hopefully, come across them.
it's still seven away. Come on, seven more followers to hit 350. Welcome back. I've arranged a special price on the broom upgrade for you. I truly appreciate all of your help. You'll be thrilled with that broom, I promise you. Loving it, Chris, mate. Absolutely loving it. I'm well addicted. I must tell you, Arthur Volksmead's been by the shop asking about rumours of a broom upgrade. Without the information you provided, my work would have taken twice as long. Thank you again. It may sound ambitious, but I've already begun work on another it's upgrade. It's going to be a big game as well. The last. It reminds me I a lot of... Uh, would you be interested in joining forces again? So uh, Oblivion and Skyrim and the way it clears. Miss Reyes has mastered. If you were to test this first upgrade there, it may help me as I develop the next. Oh, you'll consider it, won't you? Sounds as if you're really outdoing yourself. If I'm able to help, I will. Thank you. I know this recent success was only the beginning of what I can do for Broom Flight. Report back as soon as you can, and yeah. we'll be off to the races. Um, the inventory could definitely be better. Uh, I think he should be able to sell portions and stuff as well. Because the only thing that you can sell is clothing items. I can't sell any of the wand handles. I can't sell any of the, the flowers or the mushrooms that I pick up. Any of the portions. So, it, yeah. It, the inventory side of it could be better. Off to the races, then. I can't use me broom yet. I can craft portions. I think it just would be better if you could sell them as well. But yeah, I'm already crafting potions and growing me own Chinese chomping cabbages or whatever they are. And I'm just waiting for the owl, so uh, this is my second file. I've got one that I play off stream as well, that's a little bit further on than this. So I'm waiting for the owl to turn up that tells me I can go to the beast class. Then I can start collecting beasts.
Yeah, we well, can breed them and all sorts. Um, and you can sell the byproducts of them. You can sell like the furs and stuff. You I mean, regret I crossing my path. Okay. My corner. Here we are. Mr. Weeks wasn't wrong about the mountain views. If it isn't the fastest Gryffindor. <sighs> yeah, I shut you up last time. Hello, Imelda. So, another trial? <laughs> of course it's another trial. And you'd better be taking part. Yeah, you can weave it into your clothes and stuff. Does this mean you've changed your mind about me? Well, you're a step up from the good-for-nothings who usually challenge me. While they sit around and hope to be the best, I put in hours of practice. No one sets records by wishing for them, and I need strong competition to stay on top of my game. Are you going to try to beat my flying record or not? I'm ready to fly. Finally, a decent challenge. Room's definitely a bit quick, I like. I'd say that was acceptable. I'm not very good at this flying bit, like. Excellent. Ooh, sugar. Shit. Made it. Definitely not getting the hang of this. Sorry, I'll catch up on chat in a sec. One. I'd say that was acceptable. Excellent. Shit, missed two. Ha! <laughs> this is rather fun. Bloody hell. working on the sequel ah I'll have to look into that you've improved I must admit that was a bloody good run be careful earn a reputation for talent around here and some people get put out about it oh bloody Sounds hell like one year four days where's my anniversary yes, well, thing at like? I am anyway 
You didn't do abysmally. I can't deny that. But you'll not have the same luck on the South Coast course. We'll see, won't we? Till next time. I half expected you to back down. Rest on your laurels. See you at the South Coast trial, if you don't lose your nerve. To race this course again, Same, that go visit the podium with the leaderboard, it, where you can start the race and check your time. Another successful flight. I should let Mr. Weeks know. I can't remember how long it took us to get affiliated from when I started. It was a good few months. I'll be I've always said that travel broadens the mind. from your latest flight. I want to hear all the particulars. No, I've done too bad. I mean, what, I'm just coming up to 350 followers. Good news, Mr. Weeks. With your upgrade, I was able to set a new record at the Irondale course. Brilliant! I knew the upgrade had fantastic potential. How did your broom feel? It rides well. It does get a tad shaky at top speed, and the handle wobbles a bit when I hit a strong gust of wind. Ah, oh, yes. Hmm, I see. I think I know how to address that. Thank you. I owe you one. If it means another upgrade, the pleasure's all mine. You sound as determined as I am to improve broom flight. It's a joy to have a collaborator like yourself. If I'm right, and I do hope I am, you'll be hearing good news from me soon. Thank you again, truly. Now, oh, some people were to take them a year or two years to get affiliated, so... I don't think I've done too bad Mr. to see. Wilson, I do make a good team. Me accounts just over a year old. Knowing spells would simplify things. Never seems to work that way for me. The vendor might seem like half of fun. Revelio. You can stop a thief in their tracks with stupefy. What do we have here? A demi guys. Revelio. Which house is it in though? Most of these are twos, I can't get into twos. Only just getting the spell to get into them. Revelio. Some are bloody close. Gotta be more than one of them demi fucking things around here, like. Revelio. Fuck's sake. I've that is one thing that winds me up the fact that I can't jump over a simple little fence. Lumos.
Lumos. Yeah, like I say, I don't think I've done too bad. Um, I've got the consistency thing down now, I think. Normally these butterflies are quite close. I love this song. Thanks, big guy. Fucking there it is. Lemos. Lumos. Why did I have to take it again? <laughs> the flutter by Nah. Is it in here? Where the back was it? I've lost it. I don't know where the fuck I meant to put it again. Have I've lost where it needs to go? Revelio.
Revelio. Right. Lumos. Come here, you little fucker. Rebellion. There's another one of them chests somewhere about here that I've come across. Mother in law, any more. But yeah, it was funny that earlier, Craig, because I thought exactly the same as you and Shorty. Alohomora. Yep. Revelio. Yeah, I thought exactly the same. Oh, I'm going for a swim. Ah, uh, shut up, dog. Don't start with that. Hello, no.
Well, you know. Revelio. Mr. Moon said I had to. He said I could only get them moonstones at night time, so you know, he gave me permission. No, that's the same fucking building. Or the same rooms of how the fucking is his niece. Oh, oh, wait there. Is this where I need to be? Yes, this is where I need to be. And can I get on? I know, I'm starting to build up my own regulars, if it were. Um, I just found it funny when I mentioned it. Oh, you seen what? Rebellion. that Revelio You do me to be fair you spend more time in here, hanging out and chilling. And to be fair, I think it's done you good as well. Because you're not getting as stressed with your games. Because you used to go through phases where you couldn't think of what you wanted to play. And you'd spend hours just sat looking at the dashboard. Now, when you come on, you know what you want to go on, whether it be Pal World, whether it be Pod. Um, so I think it's done you a bit good as well. Alohomora. Where it's had the reverse for me, I now struggle to play on the game for fun. I do actually struggle on a weekend. I, I can't even face Rebellion. turning the Xbox Protego. on. Rebellion. Um. Yeah, I, just, I struggle with it now. I'm just getting around this bloody game plus watch stream. Oh, which sensations you got, Craig? I like the Thai sweet chili. Like I say, I think Craig would like this game as well. It, it, it does remind me a lot of... Just let me know if there's something... Um, um sort of Skyrim, Oblivion, the way it plays. 
Let's look at what we have, shall we? Once you start playing it. Oven roasted chicken and thyme. Ah, yeah. Hello, Ziggy Ned. How you doing, mate? These ones. I'm going to need that soon. Nothing like finding just the right thing, is there? Mm. Jam phone. Mm -mm -mm. A pleasure doing business with you. Nothing at all. Concrete and jail phone. Well, I might as well sell them ones because they're not as good as them ones. 43, 44. Them ones aren't as good as the other ones. Oh! Yeah, I mean, I think you'd enjoy it. Like I say, watching it being streamed, yeah, you might not look the like of it. But once you start playing it, I think you'll get who, just like I have. <laughs> Zig's been playing this as well. Nothing like finding just the right thing, is there? How you doing, Zeke? Let me know if there's anything else I can do. To Hope you're well. Revelio. That's close, wherever that is. Where is it? Inside his shop? Revelio. Oh, there's one of them things. Sorry, mate, I'm going in your house. I mean, I've already robbed it, but I'm going to take that as well. Ah, oh, you don't have it? Uh, okay. I reckon she did. <laughs> Good game. Yeah, I'm good, mate. Plodding along. Right, what we doing next? Well, I need to go find a troll. Well, it just says I've got to collect them. I don't know where I would get them from, though.
but I know you can't buy them. Let's do that one. I mean, they don't look too bad. They look better. But they look even better. Okay, yeah, so I've got them on. Seeing as I'm here, we'll do this one. I'm looking forward to it tomorrow, Shorty. Hello there. Nice to see you. Hello, Miss Ryan. I wanted to thank you again for your help with Rookwood and Harlow the day of the troll attack. Serona, please. And I was happy to help. Oh, those two are nothing but trouble. Glad you and your friend were here when they found you. I am too. You were speaking to a goblin here that day. Yes, Lord God. <sighs> He's a friend. It seems as though you were on good terms with him. I've known him for years. We met when I was waiting tables here as a student, well before I bought the place. He was cordial enough, but we weren't friends then. His mistrust of wizard kind ran deep. But you're friends now. We are. I hadn't seen him in years when he came in a few months ago. But he recognized me instantly, which is more than I can say for some of my own classmates. Took them a second to realize I was actually a witch, not a wizard. Not all goblins are like Ranrock and his loyalists. Lodgok is as worried as the rest of us about what's been going on. In that case, I'd like to talk with him about Ranrock in particular. Where might I find him? I assume your interest is to do with the rumors I've heard about Ranrock working with our friend Rookwood. See, do you reckon it we'll is. have to bleach If he's not here, wait, you uh, might bleach find bleach him doing business at the Hulk's head. Like, I mean, he's a I trusted want it, like, metal green, trader. Like your name is, you should mention like, that we spoke. Green. He can, understandably, be wary of witches and wizards, even ones as young as you. That said, if you're looking for information on Ranrock to help rein him in, or do you think we'll have to bleach it twice God. and dye it twice? Thank you, Serona. If you find Lord Gog, please give him my best. I don't know what you've done to make such powerful enemies, but please. Watch your back. Yeah, I want it like proper in your Rebellion. face, neon, neon green.
Oh. I'd literally just text you like two minutes ago saying, could you grab me a monster? Obviously, you would have been walking into the court as you got the message. Yeah, time and sucks. Never mind. Hello. Good to see you outside. Rebellion. You too are meat. Yeah, I did. Eh. I know, son, but yeah. Back it. Yup. Oh, there's one of them things in here. Welcome to the Ogg's Head. Any empty seat is yours. Don't mind me. Hello, Lord Gok. Sorona said I might find you here. Did she did, did she? Did she send you with I said I want it proper, no, like, loony actually, green, loony I green, green like, snot you. green. You know what I mean? It's about uh, we'll go be, go home. Now I remember the three broomsticks. Day of the troll attack. You? I am. Let's say I did. Sorona trusts me, and she thought our interests may be aligned. Hmm. Well, if Serena trusts you, very well. I may know of something that could help us both. A way to get Ranrock to confide his plans to me. I'm listening. Years ago, a heinous witch stole a sacred goblin relic. Rumor has it that it now rests in her sarcophagus, in a tomb accessible only by wizard kind. Ranrock and I had a, a falling out a while back. The relic could well repair the chasm between us. Amount of freaking boxes I've got in here though from the past couple of years. Got me freaking webcam box and everything as well. Literally, it's just like, there's one for me webcam. Now I've got Stream Deck. Obviously, the new controller I had to buy. The new capture card. The new microphone. And then the shock mount for the new microphone. Fucking ridiculous. Freaking boxes coming out me wazoo. Very well. 
I'll retrieve the relic if you promise to share Ranrock's plans with me. We will have to trust each other. I, that you will not abscond with the relic, and you, that I'll share what I learn. Gather whatever supplies you may need and meet me near the witch's tomb. Is it the only thing that's still the same from my original setup is the actual Xbox and the two monitors. That's it. Centaurs have never had much use for wizard kind, have they? Oh, mate, it's a fucking massive wazoo. Duelist in history. It's like a fucking wizard sleeve, mate. Revelio. Right, so yeah, I don't think anything by the two monitors in the actual Xbox are the same as when I started this streaming fucking journey, whatever you want to call it. I'm ready. Good. There's no time to lose. What precisely is the relic I'm to retrieve? A valuable heirloom known as the Helmet of Ertgot. The witch considered herself a collector and purchased the helmet as a trinket. She cared not what pain she what, caused Jordy? the goblins. Don't goblins watch. believe that the rightful owner of any object is its maker, not its purchaser. Wizard kind see things differently. It's a wonder goblins and wizards have ever been able to work together. The differences between our kinds are myriad. They seem to be. It may surprise you to know that I do not believe those differences always to be insurmountable. It is the reason I find myself traveling with you to this tomb today. I mean, I could have said, well, kiss my ass and call me, and call me Robin Hood. Revelio. I don't know what the fuck I'm meant to do with this one, like. Lumos. Is this what I'm meant to do with these? Yes! There we gone. Well, that was a complete and utter fluke. Uh, two seconds. You can either drink an invisibility potion. Uh, oh shit. Uh, or you need a Where's it at? Where's it at? Where's it at? It's 
called Dis Disillusionment. You learn it off, um, is it Garrus? It's quite early on. He sneaks you into the library. Shorty should definitely have that spell by now. I think Shorty's further into the game than me. With me being on two save files. No, it's Sebastian. Sebastian that you learn that off, not Gareth. Yeah, you get 500 gold out of each one of them chests. But like I say, you learn that spell quite early on. So you should have it. Like you say, you learn it off Sebastian when you go into the library, into the restrict into the restricted section. Ah, and there it is. The witch's tomb. Dreadful looking place, isn't it? Handy resource indeed. I wish you luck retrieving the helmet. As a wand carrier, you should have an advantage. Now, before you set off, do you have any questions? Don't suppose you have any idea what could be waiting for me inside the tomb? Considering a dark witch was involved, I suppose there's a chance you may encounter the dark protectors. Anything you stuck on, Shorty, no just ask. Theory. If I know how to do it, I'll the tell you. The foul creatures thrive on darkness and the cold. Vanquish them with light, force, and most effectively, fire. Fire. It all seems clear to me now that we're here. I do hope our alliance proves... I will remain here, eagerly awaiting your return. Tune! So can you, can you guys tell the difference in... Now I've changed microphone. Does it sound any different? Obviously, I can't tell, because I'm on this end. Revelio. It's sealed. Oh, curious. Lumos. Merlin's beard. Good. I say, mate, it's... I know, I got a bit fucking fed up the other day. I can't remember whose stream I was in. And I mentioned that I was getting this microphone. And they were like, ah, oh, that's a beginner's microphone. And they were like, oh, don't take offense. It's like, I've only been streaming fucking 10 months, 11 months. I am a fucking beginner. And this microphone had an amazing reviews. This I've gone from... The witches too. 25 quid microphone to, to a 100 odd quid microphone.
So for me, it's a massive step up, but there uh, are to beginners, Mike. And say, oh, fuck's sake. Lumos. They were on about spending like 250, 300 quid on a mic. I have a feeling I'm not alone here. I'm not asked about that, son. But, like I say, we'll figure someone out. Lumos. I just hope she's not a fucking psycho. If I could power it somehow, it looks like it could be rotated. Just not as well. I'm just lying at your feet. I know they've got tackies because they restocked the shelves. Yeah, and I don't like the zombie one. It's fucking cucumber and something else. Not nice. Huh. 
No idea, son. Purple dog. Need to get that platform closer. But how? I have no idea, son. What, shorty? What are you puking at? The purple Doritos. We don't even know what flavor they are. Leo's just asking me about them there, saying that he found them. What's that hanging there? Looks precarious. Down I go. No other way. Not going fucking down there yet. Sealed shut from the other side. Other band was just asking there if I'd uh, take him down to Bishop Auckland next week. Go to his girlfriend's house. I didn't want that. Oh. I'll fucking do. Must be quite a ways into Bishop because it reckons it's going to take us like 45 minutes to get there. He's offering me petrol money in exact in uh ah, he was offering us petrol money to take him down. It's like fuck off. Daft shit. Good finger. Incendio. Just getting rid of the other ones, man. I don't need more. Good for you. Incendio. 
Idea, mate. He did tell me, but I forgot already. Lumos. Hmm. Hmm. So you're gonna have to go in there. Remember this bit now. This is a fucking pain in the ass. Right, you go on there. Lumos. Come here, little flutter by. Looks even more complex. Hello, VD sub. Right. Let's put you on there. Oh, okay, that didn't want to go on there. Hmm. There we go. Got it. The witch's final resting place. Lodgok said the helmet was in her sarcophagus. Rebellion. A dead Ashwinder. Oh, I think good. I had to show this to Lodgok. The helmet be gone. I know there's a mechanism to open this door. Yeah, it's a cool game. I'm enjoying it. Nah, all you do, Craig, Lord when Doc, Shorty's not playing. The sarcophagus it, had been raided. Get Shorty's profile on the your Xbox. Only a dead Ashwinder. Damn, they got here first. We need to get it before Rookwood uses it to further ingratiate himself to no, Ranrock. No. I saw one of their campsites not far no. from here, but I fear you must go in alone. My fighting days are behind me. What? No. No. Oh. I mean, that would work as well. Or you just say 40 quid for one hell of a time. No! He's selling his body to you, shorty. 40 quid. The ride of your life.
I'll head there now. Good. There's no time to lose. Get to that helmet before Rookwood does, or we will lose our chance at any leverage, no matter how small, with Ranrock. To think those wretched thieves have their hands on such a relic. Lord Gok, what should we do about the helmet thieves? I'm afraid there's no choice but to stop them. Go to their camp and deal with them at once. Get to that helmet before Rookwood does, or we will lose our chance at any the leverage, no matter how small, with Ranrock. We'll make it five seconds then, Craig. Build the suspense a bit. Days. I know. I know. Rebellion. Shall we? I have things to do. Confringo. Revelio. Well, it looks like it's glitched into the floor. challenges is to use a spell um the pulse or, or something on somebody that's ah uh, that one whilst they're in the air bye bye kill your beans lad Okay. 
There they are. The Ashwinders. Aha! Uh -huh. I see you! Uh -huh. ha. You're easier to spot than an irrumpent! Oh, shit! Aha! Uh -huh. Back for more. Let me go. You little brat! Hey, that should be huh? one of the challenges. like right where did that troll die troll boogies rebellion that's part of another challenge as well i can't remember which one but I know it was part of one of my challenge uh, one of my challenges. Go to beast class. Yes, I need to go do that next. I casted the pulse saw on a levitated enemy. Okay, I'll have to do that again. Ooh, I only need six more house tokens. So I need to use the levitating spell. Right, let's sort something out. Right, I've got this here. So if I put that there, that there, I need to use them too. That's it. This is for Rookwood. I'll watch the light go out of your eye. Depulsor. Oh, well, that's fucking helpful. Let's have a Let me also. Hang on.
Revelio. Give me stones. Smash them up. There's got to be a challenge somewhere. Yeah, there is up here. Could it be a Marlin trial? Would it be? No. I don't know if this is going to work. Well, that's not it. Because I've suspended Al Fekin 3. Have you done this one, Shorty? Do you know what this one is? Wingardium Leviosa.
Wingardium Leviosa. Repulsor. Wingardium Leviosa. Wingardium Leviosa. Rebellion. I don't know if you've seen these before. Landing platforms for your broom. and a bit unsettling what to do I retrieved the helmet well it looks stunning Lodgok I see why you wanted it back you did the thieves a service by recovering it I know many a goblin who would have killed for it ah then I'm glad to be rid of it myself thank you this should yeah. earn Ranrock's trust I will take it to him immediately it may distract him from his search his search it, uh, it is merely an inkling. You have impressed me greatly, friend. I am glad that I trusted you. We shall speak soon. Best to keep our arrangement quiet for now. Many will not believe that our aims might possibly be aligned. Right, I can go to Beast class now. And that's exactly where I was going. See, I thought Shorty was further on than me. Welcome, everyone. I see you've already met some of the many... You can...
can use my brush. Just be gentle. Oh, and think pleasant thoughts. I like to think it enriches his experience. That's lovely. I'm sure he feels much better. I think he might be hungry. Would you mind giving him some beast feed? What do you suppose the pellets taste like to Gerald? Pudding, I like to think. <laughs> I think we can safely say that Gerald likes you. What you stuck on? That's good news. He seems very nice. He is. Kindness is one of his best qualities, right after ambition and cleanliness. Good work, everyone. Now, let's make our way to the pens and select another beast. And please, do be careful as you feed and groom them. Miss Sweeting, why don't you show our new student to the measles in the farthest pen? This way. The measles are over here. Oh, a couple of measles whiskers ought to get me a few canuts. Those two don't belong anywhere near this class. Poachers in training. Persephone was on to them instantly. Thank you for your help. Let's carry on. Feed and brush the measles just as you did with Gerald. <laughs> the measles really took to you. They know a good egg when they see one. As do I. It appears our time has come to an end. Now, where is our new student? Ah, there you are. Hello, Professor. You wanted to speak with me? I did. How did you find your first lesson? It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going right, to enjoy this class. The money to Good! You seem to understand that when beasts are properly controlled, they can play a vital role. Some provider which does not yes professor then stumbling short hmm professor we be on the lookout for my meanwhile psst, psst. over here do you need something poppy thank you were i certainly hope that's a good thing oh, it's something no. my gran and i say it means at least that's what i couldn't stand there and watch them hop we're of a similar mind. Actually, in... You've intrigued me. Very well. Lead the way. I'd hoped I would. I wouldn't take just anyone there. In fact, you're the first. Really? Well, thank you. I think. As I said, we think alike. Pleasant surprise. What's the weather you're having, don't you think? Poppy, where are you taking It really is much better if I just show you. Don't worry, we're nearly there. It's just ahead. Stand back. Please meet High Wing. 
Isn't she just magnificent? <laughs> Go on, introduce yourself to her. But be careful. You must always show hippogriffs the proper courtesy before you approach them. I am the yeah, air. Yeah. Just for now. Just waiting for the new mud runner to come out. I knew it. I don't think I've ever seen a hippogriff take to someone this quickly. You can feed and brush her if you'd like. I come and check on her every once in a while. Bring her pasties, tell her what's going on in the castle. You wouldn't know from looking at her, but she's a dreadful busybody. Nah, not interested in it anymore, mate. Not at the minute, anyway. So, what did you think of High Wing? I thought she was brilliant. Can't believe you introduced me to her. I suspected you two might get along. Are you the reason students have been seeing hippogriffs flying above the Forbidden Forest? Hmm, perhaps. Did you know that once you earn a hippogriff's trust, they'll always be there for you? I've seen it firsthand with her. How exactly did you and High Wing cross paths? It's a longer story. You may have noticed... Professor Howen mentioned... I don't... The poacher's influence is growing. They're up to something. That does seem strange. Sounds as if they're planning something. Exactly. I think I'm going to look into it. I'm not sure that's such a good idea. The poachers seem a dangerous lot. They don't scare me. Besides, I'd do anything to keep Highwing safe. You seem undeterred. Will you let me know what you find out? Oh, very well. I will. I should be going, but we'll speak again soon, I hope. You feel free? Oh, is that because you've finished the season? Hello, friend. I wonder if you might stop by the three broomsticks when you can. I would like your help with something. As I mentioned, my sister Anne misses Hogwarts. She hasn't been herself lately. I'd like to take you up on your promise to visit her with me. I'm heading to Feldcroft soon, so I'll look forward to seeing you there. It's just south of Hogwarts. By the way, hope you're faring well with the blasting curse. It's still one of my favorites. Now that you've attended Beast's class, I've asked Deke to assist you in using the room to further your studies in that regard. Please meet him there when you can. I'm going there now, woman. Deke. Ah, Deke is so happy to see you. And Deke noticed this bag in the room the other day. You must need it to help with your schoolwork. Deke has seen one of these before. Deke calls it a knapsack. Perfect for gathering and transporting beasts. Pleasant little breeze. I have been thinking about something Professor Howen said in Beast's class, that I should study as many beasts as I can on my own time. She also mentioned that poachers have been active in the area. So, perhaps the beasts will be safer with us than out on their own. Precisely what Deke was thinking. You see, the room knew exactly what you needed, and luckily, Deke can show you how to best use the knapsack and where. Come along, then. Our first stop... ...in quite some time. I've been beside myself with worry. Could you meet me in the courtyard?
don't know if I like that. Me free. I'm ready to learn how to use the knapsack. Perfect! Deke loves an outing. That was a dark time in Deke's life. Deke found himself in service of the cruelest wizard he ever met. Deke hated working for him. He did horrible things to beautiful beasts. Oh. It was during those days that Deke first saw a knapsack. Uh, it'll be nice to see one used for good. We have arrived. Deke enjoys coming here to watch the beasts, especially the puffle of puffskeens nearby. It would be nice to keep them safe. All you will need to do is get close, direct the open knapsack toward the puffskeen, and in it'll go. All right. Now, now, I'm only trying to help. Don't. I managed to rescue a puff skin. You can rescue as many as the knapsack will hold. Poachers capture puff skeins and, well, Deke isn't sure what they do with them. Uh, Deke is certain they will be safer with you. Now, not all beasts will be as simple to rescue as a puff skein. Deke suggests you next find a beast that can fly. A job and all, perhaps. All right. Where would I find one? Deke knows of some to the west, nesting in a large tree overlooking Hogwarts. But we must be careful. Deke has seen poachers in the area recently. Deke will meet you there whenever you're ready. Off to the next.
Rebellion. They come after me, they'll rest in ten graves. One of the little bastards scratch me. Confringo! Oh. <laughs> Thought you had me there. Huh? <laughs> ah, so close. <laughs> it's Cynthia's! <laughs> Let me <laughs> oh. Arrest them, <laughs> The beasts around here can sleep a bit easier now. Revelio. Perfect. Target practice. Let's see what's up your sleeve this time, Merlin. of me. Then one the nice easy trials. I think they're the easiest trials out a lot. Way to put you out of here. Hello, Deke. Shall we continue? Oh, good. Deke was worried about you, what with all the poachers in the area. Perhaps we should work quickly. The Jobanals are just here, in this large tree. If it's helpful, Deke has seen Levioso used to slow flying beasts. Easier to get in close and use the knapsack. Uh, shorty, I purposely haven't had any hair cut as well, so if the back of my hair gets dyed, it's fine. We can just shave it off. Then I shall go and rescue a Jobanal. Good luck. Deke will be waiting. Hmm. 
No need to be the <laughs> Professor Howard will never believe this. Cooperate, won't you? Everything's all right now. Hmm. That'll do. I've got a few. Rebellion. I rescued a jobbernal. Deke hopes your jobbernal finds the knapsack nice and cozy. Poachers want them for their feathers and are not kind when they gather them. Are there any other beasts nearby? Just one that Deke knows of, a herd of moon calves. They live in a clearing of trees up this footpath. Deke will see you there. On another adventure, are we? Hello, Deke. Is this the clearing you mentioned? It is. Moon calves gather near the large tree with the spiral pattern in front, but only under the light of the moon. So, unfortunately, unless you have a way to hasten time, you might sometimes have to wait until nightfall to see them. I shall go and find a moon calf then. Deke will be waiting for your return. No, you don't. Settle yourself. I mean you no harm. I'm only trying to help. a bit trickier than the others, but I have a moon calf now. Another beast, safe and sound. Shame we didn't see the moon calves dancing. It's a marvelous sight. 
Deke supposes you're finished here. He'll be able to rescue many more beasts, but for now, let's bring the ones you've gathered back to the room. All right. Deke will meet you back in the room whenever you're ready. There you are. Now, we need to show the beast you rescued their new home. But, um, not enough room to let them out here. Imagine all those beasts running amok. That wouldn't do at all. Perhaps if you focus on what your beasts need, the room will provide. Hmm, what exactly did you think of? Heavens! You've done it! But what is it? Deke isn't sure. Only one way to find out. <laughs> you did it! But what is it? I Meet don't know. you inside when you're ready. That's fucking brilliant. Look at this. It's amazing. Where are we, Deke? It seems to be a place for your beasts to live, a vivarium of some sort. Oh, your beasts will be quite comfortable here. They'll live healthy, safe lives. Perhaps you want to release them. Let them see their new home. thinks the vivarium will be a fitting new home for your beasts. Indeed. I only hope we'll have enough space for all of them. Deke hopes so too. But if you do run out of room, Madam Peck at Brood and Peck in Hogsmeade will help to find safe homes for them. Any beasts that the room can't hold? Yes, she's well known for helping to care for beasts in need, and she'll give you a fair price for them. Speaking of care, beasts that are well-fed and groomed will provide you with valuable magical materials, such as puffskin hair, for example. If you gather some magical materials from your beasts, Dee can show you how to use them. Very well. I shall let you know when I have some. Wonderful.
There's a bird missing. Yes, there's a bird missing somewhere. See it. Yeah, you can't even reach into the water. That sucks. I've collected some magical materials, Deke. Now, Deke can show you how to use them. First, you'll need to use this spellcraft to conjure an enchanted loom. An enchanted loom? Exactly. It will allow you to use your magical materials to weave magic into the very threads of your clothing, making your clothing more useful in a variety of ways. Why don't you try it? Deke thinks you'll be impressed with what the loom can do. I'll go and experiment with the loom now.
Right, guys, I'm going to have to end it there. I've got to go and pick my son up from Auntie Tracy's house. Because he's fell over and done his ankle in. Oh, let's find somebody to raid. Mr. Dread. He needs the followers again, guys. It's a brand new account that he's on. So if you can stick around, drop him a follow. He's a great lad. Um, yeah, like I say, give him a follow. He's a great lad. And like I say, he's on a new account, so he needs the followers. For some reason, it's only taken three out of the six years across. Uh, okay, now it's taken four years. But yeah, like I said, drop him a follow. It would be greatly appreciated from me and him. And I'll catch you Thursday.